Hey guys, Christmas Eve is here, and I've decided to do a tag. I'm doing the Seven Deadly Sins of a Model Horse Collector tag by Fine. It was created by Finey Lover, and so yeah. Um, and I know I've been using the mic a lot, but that's mainly because I haven't been feeling very good, and I haven't been fel feeling like filming at all. Um, also, the two auditions I did kind of required the mic, so. Yes, and also, Merry Christmas, since I'm filming this, and hopefully we'll get this posted today. So, yeah. Okay, so, start with the questions. The first one is greed. What is your least expensive model, and what is your most expensive model? My least expensive, um, as far as traditionals go, would have to be my old timer, which was like $29 when I got it. My most expensive, by far, would have to be probably big checks to cash, or um, a shameless, because they were over forty dollars, both of them. So, wait, how much was Elska? Um, I'm not sure. It was either Elska, big checks to cash, or um, a shameless. So yeah. Okay, I'm getting concerned. Sorry, I'm cooking something on the stove and it's like boiling over. Well, it's. No, it's not boiling over. Is it? I'll worry about it later. Because it's just water, so it can't cause so much of a problem, I hope. So, let's move on to the next one Wrath. What model do you, what model do you have a love hate relationship with? Hands down, Heartbreaker. I love his mold, but it's really tippy, and to get him to stand on his own is like impossible. And he's my only traditional foal. I love him. I love his coloring. He's beautiful. Um, I love his mold. Um, I really like the conga that mold, but it's so tippy. I just love the horse. The mold is just so tippy. <clears throat> Gluttony. What is your favorite model? My favorite model that I own would have to be Big Checks to Cash. Because I had wanted him for a long, 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 long time. And I got him. So, yeah. He's beautiful. He has great dappling. Um, yeah. Sloth. What do you hate about your model horses? Basically how expensive they are. Yeah. Especially growing up with classics and then starting to collect traditionals. It's extremely more expensive. So yeah. Um. Pride. What model are you most proud of? I would say that'd be my Elska since she is my first flagship model and I love her <laughs> yeah and we drove all over trying to find a tack shop that we passed probably several times that day yeah <laughs> we were trying a ta we were trying to find a tack shop that we found that was a flagship retailer so we would have her um and it takes forever we didn't look all the way back. We probably passed the store like a dozen times. That's because um, the info was outdated on the Briar website. It was not up to date. And we passed it probably a thousand times. Hopefully I can convince my grandma to take me back there one day and I'll do a Briar shop video on there. Okay. So, pro okay, this is the lust. What do you look for in a new model horse? Um, if it's a model, if it's in a mold that I like, if it's a model that I've really been wanting, um, if it's a regular run or a limited run thing, um, it, basically is this a model that's going to be around for a while, or is it a model that I should grab while it's there? Um, the condition of the model, um, if it has any big outward blemishes, um, that's if you actually have a choice of what you get if you're ordering like from the bar website then you really don't have a choice but still MV is number seven what is your grail hands down S just a dream yeah um, I wasn't really collecting when S just a dream came out and I've seen her on um, 
eBay for like seventy dollars. So I really hope that one day she's on eBay and I have the money to get her and I can get her. So yeah, she is like. I won't think my collection will be complete without a just a dream. It just won't. So yeah, I just have to keep an eye out for her. So okay, I think I'll start doing.